respected students welcome back everyone see today's video is not technical but it is completely different video regarding how to give the interview and the most important thing in interview is confidence and communication so how to gain so today's topic is about how to gain confidence and make communication smoother for the interviews so that you will easily conquer the interviews okay properly with my personal experience or with my uh, many students i have seen or some of the company colleagues i have seen that all everything experience i am going to share in this video okay how to gain confidence and make english communication smoother okay so stay till the end if you are new on our channel make sure you are subscribing and pressing bell icon for all upcoming videos and follow us on social media especially instagram and telegram <clears throat> ठीक है नाउ लेट स्टार्ट विद द वीडियो सी मेनी टाइम्स आई हैव टोल्ड यू दैट थ्री थिंग्स आर रिक्वायर्ड टू कॉन्कर द इंटरव्यू थ्री थिंग्स थ्री सीज ओके सी सो फर्स्ट सी इज कंसेप्ट सेकेंड इज कॉन्फिडेंस एंड थर्ड इज कम्युनिकेशन ठीक है नाउ लेट्स अज्यूम दैट योर कंसेप्ट विच आर देर फॉर एग्जाम्पल इफ यू आर गिविंग इंटरव्यू इन डेटा एनालिटिक्स for power bi tool or tableau or sql or anything or any interview you are giving technical interview i am saying in it industry so if you uh, any tool based interview you are giving at least 60 to 70% concepts should be cleared of those tool whether you are going as a fresher or whether you are going as a experienced doesn't matter but 60 70% concept should be cleared for example if you are giving interview for power bi developer in data analytics so in c power bi you must know power bi Uh, power query power bi desktop and power bi service for experience for a fresher power query power bi desktop is okay and bi service can be basic theek okay, hai so concepts should be 60 to 70% clear now let's start with our proper video we will start with english communication first point is if your english communication is not good then what to do see here i have written 20% 80% what does it mean that 20% the first point which is there if you follow that it will help you 20% and second point if you follow it if it will help you 80% okay now starting with the first point watch english movies read newspapers books and blog articles okay so it is going to help you only 20% now you will be shocked that how come if uh, doing many things even uh, watching movies or reading newspaper blog books and everything it is going to help 20 25% only see by watching english movie uh, you will get those important words or reading newspaper new words will be introduced to you okay with books blogs everything but if you are speaking second point but speaking english with uh, english with family and friends is best okay if you are speaking english with your friends and family na see literally it is going to help you so much ठीक है इफ यू वांट टू लर्न द स्विमिंग एंड इफ यू आर वाचिंग वीडियोस ऑन यूट्यूब और यू आर रीडिंग आर्टिकल रिलेटेड टू हाउ टू स्विम ठीक है हाउ टू स्विम वेदर इन टैंक और कैनल और एनीवेयर ठीक है ओशन एनीवेयर बट इफ यू आर जस्ट वाचिंग द वीडियोस ऑन यूट्यूब हाउ टू स्विम एंड रीडिंग द आर्टिकल्स और टेकिंग एनी टिप्स फ्रॉम यूर स्विमर फ्रेंड दैट हाउ टू स्विम एंड वेन यू विल गो इन दैट वॉटर and when you will do that when you will take that practical experience there uh, is the thing where you are going to learn the swimming theek hai not just by watching youtube videos or not just by reading the articles or not just by listening to any tips of your friends and how to swim but when you will go in water when you will do that uh, <clears throat> hand and all leg movement that time only you are going to learn swimming properly same is with english See, just by reading uh, newspaper or watching English movies, books, blogs, anything which is there. <coughs> I'm sorry. So, uh, just by following this first point, it is going to help you twenty twenty five percent only. But speaking with your friends and family, it is going to help you so much. See, there is the only thing where your tenses which are there, past, present, and future tense, these are going to. Uh, b means proper you will understand what is the difference between past present and future tense then what is the actual difference between voices active and uh, passive voice 
so speaking english with your friends and family is going to help you so much and for example if you have done any course related to it and if your uh, friends are also there then start speaking start speaking english with them only or with your teacher only continue speak with uh, them in english only see let me be frank don't speak in marathi or hindi or uh, whatever your language is there with your friends and family those who are who are also hunting for job speak with them in english only and not related to technical all other work for example if i went to gym and you are having conversation with your friend that i i have went to gym today i have done chest or legs or anything speak with him in english only that also the communication the daily communication which is there that should also be in english only see one example uh, i will give one of my friend was there uh, he was having 2 years of experience and he had worked with english uh, sorry indian clients only so with indian clients he used to speak in marathi and hindi only as uh, from maharashtra and north the client was there but when he switch in other company and completely foreign clients came uh, he faced uh, this thing that first one or two month he was not able to speak pro- properly english and their accent which was there uk and us section he was not able to channelize only that he was not able to understand only that but what happened one of his team member was from uk and he started speaking with him and he, then they became good uh, best friends and everything and after even i have seen that when i met him after 3 4 months his english was really good it changed by around 60 70% we can say and that guy was completely from marathi medium not also same english huh? same english is like 50% english is there in school college days but he was completely from marathi medium and with 3 4 months of speaking english with a us guy his english was completely changed grammatical mistakes were not happening nothing theek okay? hai so make sure you are speaking english with your friends and family especially friends our family members can't speak uh, that properly english and second one tip i want to give the one who are engaged the one who are watching the video let me be frank the one who are engaged who is having girlfriend boyfriend anything speak with them also in english Re- really i am saying it is going to help you very much if your english is good na you are at least 30% interview is conquer there only and if your communication confidence plus communication is good more than 50% of interview is completed there only but very properly it should be there and i am not saying that for it interviews your english should be so much at advanced level or anything you should be able to speak everything but at least you should be able to frame the sentence at least you should be able to have conversation you should survive there see the rule of nature is survival of fittest theek okay? hai you should be able to frame the sentence you should be able to have conversation you should be able to write the emails properly have conversation with client demo the your reports this you should know properly third point which is there face the mirror and front video camera and start speaking see what you can do go in front of mirror and uh, if you have prepared introduction for the interview theek okay? hai or if any topic is there like difference between star scheme and snowflake schema or what is sql if you have uh, prepared that topic go in front of mirror or uh, use your mobile phone and record front uh, record with your front video camera and speak 2 minutes and afterwards you only watch that video whether i am doing mistake or nothing theek okay, properly so this third point is also important fourth point is if able to frame the sentence along with tenses ha this i have already told if you are able to frame the sentence everything properly have conversation properly then you are best but no doubt that uh, it is not required that advanced level of english only you should know. even i don't know advanced level of english frankly speaking but you should be able to have conversation with indian clients and also foreign clients i am demoing every day every day i am demoing <clears throat> our reports having conversation with english client i am able to understand their english and also have proper conversation with them okay this is the main thing so about communication everything i have told you theek okay? hai now let's move to the confidence theek okay? hai see the first point only what i have written if your english is good automatically confidence will be good only yes this is the correct this is the most important point why your confidence is low if your communication is not good then automatically it is going to impact your confidence no matter what level of confidence you are having but if your english is only not good then you will be not able to face the video camera in interview properly and face to face winter interview you forget only that 
ठीक है लेट मे बी फ्रेंक समाइम्स आई एम सो मच फ्रेंक ठीक है बट इफ यूर इंग्लिश इज गुड यू विल बी एबल टू इजिली फेस द वीडियो कैमरा वीडियो इंटरव्यू ऑल्सो एंड फ्रंट टू फ्रंट इंटरव्यू ऑल्सो यू विल बी इजिली Uh, able to face it, not an issue. If one or two panelists is there, no issues. ठीक है? Second, हाँ, this is the main point. अ, this second point. Let me be frank here also. Don't be afraid of interviewer. See, uh, what I have seen, even I have also taken the interview. Till today, I have not understand why students or candidates are afraid of interviewer or panelist. See, there is nothing to be afraid of them. ठीक है? Let me be frank. Even I have seen that. I was taking one interview and that guy was literally shivering in front of me. What is there? I am going to ask related to data analytics only, na? If you are not able to do it, what I am going to do or what that interviewer is going to do? He is going to reject you. That's it. Nothing is going to happen. He is not going to come and kill you, na? So there is nothing to be afraid of interviewer. Okay, your first interview will be re you will be rejected from that due to your low confidence or weak English. Second will be rejected. Fifth will be rejected. Ten interviews will be, you will be rejected. But day by day, if you are growing or making changes, your eleventh interview will be hundred percent. You will be able to conquer it. You will pass in that interview. ठीक है? So there is nothing to be afraid of interviewer. Don't be afraid of them. Always have a proper smile throughout the interview. See, mostly ninety percent of interviews after COVID they are happening on video camera only. In Our days or initial days, we have went to companies, and like two three companies, daily interview was there. One company was at Hadapsar, and from there twenty kilometers, other company was there, and from then eight nine kilometers, other company was there. From north to south, those interview we have, we have given that to in uh, rainy season or winter season or even in summer uh, season also. Front to front, we have given interview, but we were not afraid of the panelist even. In our fresher days also, see there is nothing to be afraid of them. The what they are going to do, they are just going to reject you. That's it. Nothing is going to happen. Okay. So have proper smile. You should sit properly. Remove your chest, shoulders, little bit back. Okay. Proper dress you should have. If you are having tie, then you can wear. But don't give interview on t-shirts. Properly shirt should be there. And your first button which is there, that should be also proper. Okay. So no need no. Uh -huh. And last point is just take care of your expression. Huh? That I already have told. That see, expression is like you should have smile throughout the interview and make sure you are having eye contact with him properly on your lens which is there. Now nah? have eye contact with him properly. Body movement also have chest a uh, little bit front and uh, shoulders and hand movements. What you are doing now? Nah? See what I follow when I give interview. I do uh, use both hands and do proper movement like. Uh, if i am speaking technical then uh, i use right hand if i am speaking little bit different related to it then i use left hand also i am having continuous watch in my uh, watch on my hand theek okay? hai these are the some of the important things you should have and if your english is good automatically confidence it will be good don't be afraid of him if you are not afraid of him automatically your confidence will also boost theek okay? hai and 60 to 70% concept should be cleared properly ठीक है इवन इफ यू हैव एनी डाउट रिलेटेड टू कॉन्फिडेंस कम्युनिकेशन मेक श्योर यू आर मैसेजिंग मी ऑन इंस्टाग्राम आई एम ऑलवेज अवेलेबल ऑन इंस्टाग्राम यू कैन मैसेज मी ऑल्सो इफ एनी डाउट यू कैन कमेंट बिलो दिस वीडियो विद इन वन आवर टू आवर्स आई विल रिप्लाई टू यू ठीक है थैंक्स फॉर वॉचिंग टिल एंड एंड इफ यू हैव इफ यू आर न्यू ऑन आवर चैनल मेक श्योर यू आर सब्सक्राइबिंग प्रेसिंग बेल आइकॉन फॉर ऑल अपकमिंग वीडियोज थैंक्स ऑल अट एवरी